midlife and business. Hi, I'm Lucy Griffiths and I am on the upper side of 40. And I know what it's like to feel like, oh, am I too old to do this? Should I be in business? But I promise you, there has never been a better time to kick off your business and get going. Because we get to a stage in our professional life where, I don't know about you, but I certainly felt like I'd reached the end of the road, that I didn't want to be in the office um, with my son. I wanted to be, have, you know, take a step back and be more with him. And I also felt like I worked in TV news and that it was a young person's game. And I really didn't fit in anymore. And when I started looking for other careers, other options, I felt really unemployable. I just felt I lost all my confidence and I really didn't feel like, oh, I know what I want to do. And I felt like I was gonna to have to start again. And I didn't want, I was tired of bad bosses and just stupid management systems. And you get to a point where I just didn't have the kind of capacity for that, plus also navigating life with my young son. So for me, I really wanted to think, how can I build a career that fits my life? And so I started my online business. Now that was seven years ago. And running an online business has been so liberating, such an amazing way for me to just have that freedom, that flexibility. And so if you're in your midlife and thinking, do I start an online business? I would say yes. And the thing is that you might feel like, oh, I'm too old, I'm too old to do social media, but you are really not. The thing is that, yeah, you're not necessarily gonna to appeal to someone who is, you know, in their 20s. You might do, but you are going to appear to appeal to someone who's in their 40s, their 50s, their 60s, their 70s. And for me, I have clients who are even in their 80s because they want someone who can hold their hand and take them on the journey of helping people to build an online business. So if you're in your midlife and thinking, is this right for me? Yes, it is. There are really easy ways that you can start building an online business. And one of the most important ways is video. And so when you show up and you do video, in the beginning, it's really scary and intimidating. And you might feel like, I'm too old. No one's gonna watch this. I've got eye bags. But I promise you, there are people who resonate with you, who feel like I connect with you, and they are gonna want to buy from you. And then, also, remember that the people who are in their 40s, their 50s, they're more established in life. They've got money. And so, actually, you may be you're gonna have a smaller pool of people, but they're also gonna have resources and money because they need help. They need help from you. And you can help them to build their online business or whatever it is you're doing, you can put yourself out there. And actually they're gonna to want to work with you because they resonate with you. They like your vibe and they get to know you. So use video so they get to know you. Use some of those tools see what other young people are doing, but do it in your way so it feels unique, it feels special to you, rather than feeling like I've got to do all the things, do what works for you. For me, I love to batch my videos and create videos on YouTube, and I've got a ton of videos all about being confident on camera if you want help with that. But then, I also love LinkedIn. LinkedIn is an amazing tool for you to build an audience and it is, you know, the algorithm is really supportive so it's easier to grow an audience. And there are lots of people who are in their kind of midlife period who are wanting your, your expertise, they're wanting your help. And so you can connect with them. And you can do that in two ways. One, by creating posts on LinkedIn. So I create a post about 6.30 a.m. every morning, watch my LinkedIn video of how to get clients. And then two, also by commenting. So in the beginning, you might feel shy. Start by commenting on other people's posts and building up your muscles of confidence so that you, then you can start putting yourself out there and being more visible. 
So if you are thinking about like, what do I do? Is having a business in, you know, the midlife in later years, is it a good idea? Yes, it is. Go all in and you can create the most incredible business. And the thing is that because you are older, you have the expertise, you have the knowledge, you have that experience that your business is gonna be more successful. So it may be that you're doing it on the side while you're caring, caring for elderly parents or your children, or maybe you're doing it as a side hustle, whatever works for you, but go all in. So if you are doubting yourself and thinking, I'm too old to be in business, you are not. The best thing I can say is to really get going. Just start, even if it's starting with a side hustle, and it will grow, it will evolve, but it can give you so much more freedom and flexibility. It can give you that security as you go into your next stage of life. And it gives you the freedom so you can work from anywhere in the world and you can still care for elderly parents, be there for your children, be there for your grandchildren. And then also it just gives you that freedom. You can travel more, you're not tied to the office, you're not having to deal with bad bosses and just sucky people and office politics. And you can build a business that really works for you and your life. So if you really want some help, check out my easy launch plan below, which is a way to build an online business so that you can build it and sell. Because that's the key thing. You want to have your content and also sell it. So check that out and you know, just get going. Take that leap. If you like this video, I would love to help you. Please subscribe. I share loads of tips and strategies to help you build your online business. And I hope to see you again soon. Thanks so much for watching. Bye, bye, bye.